She once called herself the Queen of Trash. But now, as she goes on trial in Sweden's largest environmental crime case, it may transpire that Bella Nilsson never lived up to that name. Nilsson is the former chief executive of Think Pink, a once lauded waste management company hired by construction businesses, municipalities and individuals to dispose of everything from building waste to toys. But according to prosecutors, it left mounds of waste abandoned with no plans to process it. During its heyday, its pink waste bags could be spotted across the capital. And between 2017 and 2019, Think Pink was listed as one of the country's fastest growing companies. But the tide turned in 2020 when the company's owners were arrested. Several of the rubbish dumps caught fire, including this one south of Stockholm that burned for months in 2021. According to the charge sheet, the way Think Pink mismanaged waste resulted in harmful levels of arsenic, lead and other chemicals being released into the environment. A preliminary investigation ran to tens of thousands of pages. 150 witnesses are to testify in the trial that kicked off on Tuesday. There are so many traces with uh, chats and, and messages and, and emails sent to one another. So I have never seen anything like that, like 44,000 emails in one computer. I think it's the coming generations that will pay for this crime. The damage that we will see in generations' time, uh, that we can only guess. Now bankrupt, Think Pink is accused of dumping at least 200,000 tonnes of waste in 21 locations across Sweden. Nilsson, along with the 10 others accused, has denied wrongdoing and argues she's the victim of a conspiracy by company rivals. The trial is expected to last nine months.